This is a production of the Your State Ministry of Information and Orientation. A Your State Commissioner for Health, Dr. Olua Sherry Miyagetsumobi, has noted that intense capacity building training for service providers in the state is part of government's efforts to improve on a healthy and safer family living for her and to further prevent infants and maternal mortality in the state. Mrs. Ajetumobi stated this during a training and donation of family planning products by DKT International Nigeria. Speaking on her behalf, an officer from the ministry, Mrs. Falashadi Oladele, commended the unrelenting commitment of the state's primary health care board and heavy relevant stakeholders for the continued rendering of appropriate health care services at the communities and the deep grassroots. The commissioner who commended the level of education for families on child spacing and family planning said, it will in turn promote all-round health development of the mother while building a stable future for the children, thus generating a healthy state and nation in the long run. She lauded the immense continued and timely support as offered by the donor in contributing towards a safer family planning society in your state and beyond. Adding that the donor has been a progressive ally and partner in bridging the challenges of family planning supplies and inadequacies in the state. We might not know the importance of child spacing or family planning. Or just get some video clips of what happened at Far North during last week protest. You could see small boys. I imagine somebody carrying monitor, carrying chair, carrying jelly cans of oil. You can you can just assess their mental health in terms of what do they want to use that for? What are their parents doing? We thank God for the, for His grace in our state. Such has never happened and it will not happen. Amen. But we believe in our services to our people in terms of educating them on child spacing and family planning. To promote the health of the mother and to build a good future for their children. Earlier, the Executive Secretary of your State Primary Health Care Board, Dr. Muidin Babatunde Olatunji, while speaking on the persistent efforts of the state government to reduce the gaps of family planning services and commodity supply in the state, explained that some of these supplies are highly capital intensive, coupled with regulatory budgetary provision and procurement limitations by the federal government, which contributed to limited availability of these essential supplies within the state health facilities. Dr. Olatunji acknowledged the laudable gesture of DKT International for the unmatchable services rendered at the training and the donation of family planning products. He added that the heart is a beacon of hope for the state health facilities, by and large, the targeted public. Dr. Olatunji encouraged other partners to join forces in the humanitarian feat, adding that the Shei Mackendes led administration has leveraged on a conducive environment for investors and partners to thrive in the state. You yourself you are aware that the effort the country, even the states, is making is to ensure that we reverse the maternal mortality and infant mortality that we in our country. And one of the ways we can do this one is to reduce one of the causes of maternal death in our society. And when we talk about maternal deaths, one of the things that can actually cause it are the fatality or uh, being attached with pregnancies. So you, talk, you want to talk about when the pregnant becomes too uh, often too frequent or too close and are too early, uh, it will jeopardize the life of such a mother. So, and one of the best ways we can do this, one we cannot prevent sexual in, uh, interaction between a male and a female, is to be able to provide a value for them to prevent pregnancy when they desire to prevent it. In a response, Mrs. Sarah Odeniro, the Hospital Sales and Clinical Services Manager of DKT International Nigeria, on behalf of our country director and other directorate of Deep Kuma Tiyagi Foundation, DKT Nigeria, expressed the company's delight to be a partner to offer support services and capacity building training to the state service providers on long-acting reversible contraceptive, LARC. She said it would break the gap of unwanted pregnancies and unplanned childbirths while ensuring safe and appropriate family planning methods amongst couples in the state. Um, 10,000 units of um, interuterine contraceptive devices, non hormonal, and is worth the tune of um, 10 million naira being donated from the entire management of the Kumatiagi Foundation, Nigeria International, for the utilization and the uptake of contraceptive services in the entire Oyo state. In her remarks, 
the State Family Planning Coordinator of Primary Health Care Board or your state, Mrs. Fola Shade Olatunde, expressly appreciated DKT International on the collaboration to hover capacity building training services and for the priceless donation of the family planning commodity to the state and promised to ensure the safe use and judicious distribution of the supply to the grassroots and the end users through the state primary health care board. All the family planning method we have to and they are readily available. And this one too, we augment the one being provided by the state and by the federal ministry of health. So it's our, uh, you know, we are, I really appreciate it and we are very happy on behalf of the organization that donated this particular commodity to the state. Over 40 certified nurses and CNOs were drawn from the 33 local government areas of the state as participants at the training session. 